Ever wondered about the less explored places in Europe? Let's take a moment to step off the beaten path. Today, we are venturing beyond the usual tourist hotspots to discover the hidden gems that Europe has to offer in 2024. We're talking about the top 10 less touristy places that are not as crowded, but are just as beautiful and definitely worth the visit. These are the places where you can immerse yourself in authentic culture, taste local cuisine, and experience a different side of Europe that's waiting to be explored. From charming towns nestled in mountain ranges to vibrant cities rich in history and culture, we've got a diverse list that's sure to pique your curiosity. So grab your virtual backpacks, put on your adventure hats, and let's set off on this journey together, uncovering the best of less touristy Europe. We begin our countdown with number 10. At number 10, we have the Faroe Islands, a Danish archipelago. Here, the raw beauty of nature is on full display, untouched and unspoiled. The Faroe Islands are a realm of stark contrasts and dramatic landscapes, where the ocean meets the sky in an eternal dance and towering cliffs plunge into the deep blue sea. This archipelago is a paradise for wildlife enthusiasts. It's teeming with a variety of bird species and the surrounding seas are home to an array of marine life. The island's remoteness only adds to their charm, offering a peaceful retreat from the bustling world. The Faroe Islands encapsulate the allure of the wild, the serenity of solitude, and the thrill of exploration. It's a place where time seems to slow down, allowing you to fully immerse yourself in the wonder of nature's spectacle. So if you're seeking a unique and less traveled destination in 2024, the Faroe Islands should definitely be on your list. Moving on to number 9. Number 9 takes us to Plovdiv, the second largest city in Bulgaria. A city that's as old as time itself, Plovdiv has an enchanting history that spans over six millennia, making it one of the oldest cities in the world. It's a living museum, dotted with remnants of its past, like the incredibly preserved Roman amphitheater. This ancient structure still resonates with the drama and grandeur of bygone eras, hosting performances that breathe life into its stone edifice. But Plovdiv isn't just about history, it's a vibrant cultural hub, buzzing with a dynamic art scene. The city's bohemian district, Kapana, is a maze of colorful streets filled with galleries, boutiques, and cafes, where local artists display their creativity. It's a place where the old and the new seamlessly blend together, creating a unique experience that's quintessentially Plovdiv. So, if you're looking for a destination that offers a rich blend of history, culture, and art, Plovdiv is the place to be. Next at number 8. At number 8, we find ourselves in Kotor, Montenegro. This medieval city is a hidden gem nestled between towering mountains and the shimmering Adriatic Sea. Imagine standing atop the ancient fortress, the wind in your hair, as you take in the stunning views of the city below, the bay stretching out like a glistening mirror in the sun. It's a journey into the past, where stories of knights and fortresses aren't just tales in a storybook, but the living legacy of the city's stone walls. Descend from the fortress and you'll find the beautiful Bay of Kotor, a winding waterway that offers a picturesque backdrop for a leisurely boat ride. The bay's calm waters reflect the city's terracotta rooftops and the verdant mountains beyond, creating a scene that's nothing short of a masterpiece. Now step into the charming old town, a labyrinth of narrow streets and squares, each corner revealing quaint shops, cozy cafes, and centuries-old buildings. Here, history is not a thing of the past, but a part of everyday life. Let's discover number seven. Number seven on our list is Riga, the capital of Latvia. This gem of the Baltic region is a city where old meets new, a place where medieval charm coexists with modern sophistication. Let's start with Riga's architecture. It's a city that will leave you awestruck with its stunning Art Nouveau buildings. It's no wonder Riga is often referred to as the Paris of the North. Next, we journey into the heart of Riga, the medieval old town. Here, narrow cobblestone lanes unfurl to reveal an array of Gothic spires, historic landmarks, and quaint cafes. The old town is also home to the majestic Riga Cathedral and the towering St. Peter's Church, both must-sees on any visit to this city. And as the sun sets, Riga's vibrant nightlife comes alive. From trendy bars and clubs to traditional Latvian taverns, Riga offers an eclectic mix of evening entertainment that caters to all tastes. Let's move on to number six. Number six takes us to Ljubljana, the capital of Slovenia. This charming city, nestled at the heart of the country, is a haven for those seeking tranquility and natural beauty. One of its most striking features is its abundance of green spaces, which have earned it the title of European Green Capital. 
As you wander through its leafy parks and along the riverbanks, the city's commitment to sustainability is evident. A must-see in Ljubljana is the iconic Dragon Bridge. This stunning piece of architecture adorned with four dragon statues is steeped in lore and truly captures the spirit of the city. A perfect spot for a memorable photo. Perched high above the city you'll find Ljubljana Castle. This medieval fortress offers sweeping views of the city and the surrounding countryside. Its rich history and architectural beauty make it a must-visit destination on any Ljubljana itinerary. Next up, number 5. At number 5, we have Tallinn, the capital of Estonia. A city where the past and the future intertwine seamlessly, Tallinn is a hidden gem waiting to be discovered. Take a step back in time as you walk through the city's well-preserved Old Town, a UNESCO World Heritage Site. With its cobblestone streets, medieval houses, and ancient churches, this area is a living testament to Tallinn's rich history, culture, and tradition. But Tallinn is not just about the past. The city is also home to a vibrant tech scene, earning it the nickname Silicon Valley of Europe. This is where Skype was born, after all. Here you'll find a thriving community of startups and tech companies, making Tallinn a city of innovation and forward thinking. Overlooking the city is the iconic Alexander Nevsky Cathedral, a symbol of Tallinn's resilience and enduring spirit. Its onion-shaped domes and intricate mosaics are a sight to behold. Moving on to number four. Number four takes us to Cluj-Napoca, the second most populous city in Romania. This captivating city is a potpourri of culture and history nestled in the heart of Transylvania. If you're an arts and culture enthusiast, Cluj-Napoca will not disappoint. From the paintbrush factory, a contemporary art hub, to the Romanian opera and national theater, the city thrives with creativity and artistic expression. One cannot mention Cluj-Napoca without acknowledging its natural beauty. Central Park, with its grand casino building, is the city's green heart, offering a tranquil escape from the bustling city life. The Botanical Garden, another gem, is a paradise for plant lovers with over 10,000 plant species. And let's not forget the city's architectural marvels. St. Michael's Church, a stunning example of Gothic-style architecture, stands tall as a testament to the city's rich history. With its vibrant art scene, beautiful parks, and mesmerizing architecture, Cluj-Napoca truly is a hidden European gem. Let's discover number three. At number three, we find ourselves in Bratislava, the capital of Slovakia. This city is a treasure trove of experiences, waiting to be discovered by the intrepid traveler. Nestled on the banks of the Danube River, Bratislava charms with its quaint old town. Here you can wander through a labyrinth of narrow winding streets, each one telling a tale as old as time. Next, we ascend to the Bratislava Castle, a beacon of Slovakia's historical prowess. This castle is not just a monument, but a guardian of the city's past, standing tall on a hill overlooking the city and the river. From the heights of history, we journey to the heights of the future at the UFO observation deck. This modern marvel provides a panoramic view of Bratislava in all its glory. From here, the city appears as a beautiful blend of past and present, tradition and innovation. Next, at number two. Number two on our list is Ghent, a city in Belgium. An enchanting blend of the past and present, Ghent is a city that captivates the heart of every traveler. Its stunning canals, reminiscent of fairy tale landscapes, are lined with colorful houses, cafes, and shops, offering a picturesque view that is truly unforgettable. Now let's talk about Ghent's medieval architecture. The city is home to some of Europe's most impressive and well-preserved medieval buildings. From the towering Gravenstein Castle to the majestic St. Bavos Cathedral, Ghent is a paradise for history buffs and architecture enthusiasts alike. But Ghent is not just about its historical charm, the city is also a vibrant hub of arts and culture. You'll find numerous art galleries, music festivals, and theatrical performances happening throughout the year. Ghent's art scene is as diverse and dynamic as the city itself, making it a perfect destination for art lovers. So if you're looking for a place that offers a rich blend of history, culture, and beauty, Ghent is the place to be. Finally, at number one. And at number one, we have Porto, the second largest city in Portugal. A city of contrasts where tradition intertwines with innovation, Porto offers a unique blend of experiences that will delight any traveler. Imagine strolling along the Douro River, its waters reflecting the pastel-colored houses that line its banks, while the iconic Dom Luis Vos Bridge looms majestically overhead. The cityscape is a sight to behold, a picturesque tableau of old and new. Now, for the wine connoisseurs among you, 
Porto's namesake port wine is a must try. Savor its rich, sweet taste as you sit in a riverside wine cellar, the air heavy with history and the tantalizing aroma of aged wine. And let's not forget the Livraria Lello. Known as one of the most beautiful bookshops in the world, its ornate woodwork and stunning stained glass skylight are a testament to Porto's love for art and literature. And there you have it, the top 10 less touristy places to travel in Europe in 2024. We've journeyed through some of Europe's most underrated destinations, we started in the Faroe Islands, Denmark's hidden gem, and made our way to the ancient city of Plovdiv in Bulgaria. We then ventured to the coastal bay of Kotor in Montenegro, and the cultural hub of Riga in Latvia. Our travels took us to Ljubljana, Slovenia's charming capital, and the medieval city of Tallinn, Estonia. We explored the vibrant life of Cluj-Napoca in Romania, and the historic city of Bratislava in Slovakia. Our penultimate stop was Ghent, a city full of life in Belgium, and finally, we ended our journey in Porto, Portugal, a city that beautifully blends tradition and modernity. Each of these destinations offers a unique experience, filled with rich history, stunning landscapes, and vibrant cultures. They're all slightly off the beaten path, waiting for your footsteps. So, when planning your next European adventure, consider these less touristy places. Thank you for joining us on this journey. Remember, adventure awaits in the less explored corners of Europe.